Say hi, Dad. Hi, Dad. Say, my name's Dustin Dale. Can you say that? I, I work. Damn. So, I'm doing something that I never thought I would ever do. I never thought I would be in front of the camera, talking to the camera. This is the last place I want to be right now. Um, always want to be behind the camera, even as a little kid. Oh, they want to take a picture. <laughs> Well, I'm taking your picture. I right, quit. I look. Yeah. Okay. I look. I'm here. Now, I, I've hated, hated being in front of the camera. It's just one of those things that I've never wanted to do. Kind of give you a little background of why I'm doing this right now. My friend Adam and I, we've been working on a short film together. We previously shot a short film called Onyx Window a couple years ago and the feedback that I've gotten from the people that have seen it, it's been pretty cool to hear what people have to say about it. So we're, we're currently working on a new short film and in this new short film I want to utilize you know, a drone, a quadcopter. So I bought one and we were doing a few little flight tests with it and we get home um, Adam and I are looking at the footage from the what the drone had taken and, and then we decided to pull up some Casey Neistat videos and kind of watch them and it's like I kind of tell Adam, I was like, I, was like, I tried, tried to do this, you know, back a long time ago. I had a point and shoot camera, a Canon point and shoot camera. So this idea of, you know, shooting this video, constantly shooting this video in my daily life just didn't seem appealing to myself. So why would anyone else watch these videos? So as I was kind of telling Adam the story, he's like, oh, you should kind of continue doing that. You should get back into doing it. So I turned to him and I'd say, I was like, I just don't have anything interesting to say. People aren't going to want to watch me eat my cereal. It's just not that important to show. cereal but then overnight something kind of hit me and ever since then I really haven't been able to stop thinking about creating this vlog because creating a daily vlog just didn't seem interesting to me but what did seem interesting is the progress and journey that I've already made within filmmaking looking back at my old home movies you can see at the age of two what you've already seen. It's like that's all I want to do is be behind the camera. So then what you're going to see here at the age of six, that's all I still want to do was be behind the camera. Mom, when you're done, let me look for it. No, let me tape you guys. Can I taper? Can I press? Back up, there little boy Dustin wants to look again. There's mom with her shells at. See how she's just doing. Can I press these? There's Dustin. Can I look? Can I look? Can I press these? Can I do that? Nope. Nope. All right. Wait, wait a minute. I can see now why my parents are so frustrated with me asking to be behind the camera. So I've been talking about not wanting to be in front of the camera. You'd think that that would also mean that I wouldn't want to be in front of a large crowd. You also wouldn't think that I'd ask for the star role in the fifth grade Christmas play, playing Santa. Are you saying I'm not strong? I'm not saying the weakest thought. Well, think no more. Get me some weights. Oh, this will never do. <laughs> oh, my back. Getcha. I want all of you to try and tackle me. Stop! Stop! You're killing me. Come on. 
two more meals. We've got work to do. And I don't really think it was me just wanting to play the start role. I, th I think it was more than that. I think it was me just wanting to do something different. So as I'm going through this, some of these uh, home movies, and I've kind of realized one thing that all these like current vloggers within the past you know few years, like they aren't the innovators of doing this. I think all of our parents were. Today's date is August 20th, 1983. It's on Saturday. And this is the garage. Like actually, there's some boards on the ground engine, and that's the well. The north corner. East side of the house, water lines that. Hit the button. And then, you might even think that my dad was sponsored by Pioneer Corn. Ooh, look at that nice Pioneer Corn. That good Pioneer Corn. The deal. You see that good looking Pioneer Corn? Nice looking Pioneer Corn. With all the corn. Good Pioneer Corn. I think he's way ahead of his time. So that's, uh, that's about ages uh, 2 to maybe 10 or 11. I know it's not a whole lot about filmmaking right now. It kind of gives you a glimpse of me as a little kid. It was something that I never knew would turn out to be something that I'm really passionate about wanting to do today. So maybe if you're a parent yourself and you've got kids that are kind of showing signs, of kind of like how I did, it might be time to get them their own camera. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. I know this doesn't deal a whole lot with filmmaking right now, but um, it will soon. So if you enjoyed it, please subscribe. Please subscribe. I'm gonna guess I'm gonna put a subscribe button like right about here. Um, it's gonna help me out a lot. It's gonna tell me that you enjoyed it enough to where I'm gonna be more motivated to do these things. You know, it's the, the one thing I've been kind of dreading is doing all this work and nobody really cares about it. Because I don't wanna do it without actually helping some people out. So if you enjoy it, please subscribe. I've also got a Instagram account, so if you could please follow that, that'll help me out as well. So if you liked it, please click on those links. Um, if you have any questions, um, ask them in the comments below. Right now, this is just the first episode. The next episode's gonna kind of talk a little bit about my next journey and continue from there. So thank you and please subscribe. Mom. <laughs> What if we do that tape and somebody sees?